Okay, so uh, we're going to show you now how to panel pin, glue and panel pin the uh, pieces of wood together to make up the sound box perhaps for your um, stringed instrument. So a number of you have got a uh, design like that. We're going to pin through these thick, thin pieces of wood into the thicker pieces and we're going to use some glue to hold it. And a good idea, especially with plywood, before you start working with it, is to get the splintery bits off the edge. So just take the corners down with a bit of sandpaper. Plywood, plywood is noted for giving you evil splinters. Right. Now then, um, because it's always difficult to get panel pins in straight and without them bending, what you're going to do is to um, drill, a, drill a pilot hole. So take a panel pin and cut the head of it off with a pair of size cutting or combination pliers. Put the head in there, point it down at the table because sometimes the head pings off. So you've got a piece like that, flat at one end, with a point on the other end. So take a cordless drill and put the bit you just cut off in the, the chuck so that the point is sticking out like that. Uh, then you can drill through um, your uh, end of your piece of plywood. I'm going to put one panel pin in each one, that should be enough. Notice I'm doing it over the open jaws of the vise so I don't make holes in the bench. And those holes will guide the panel pins in. Now before we start putting them together, the good trick is to start the panel pins off in the holes you just drilled and then knock them through so they're just the point just comes through the other side like that. You'll see why we're doing that later on. Now a bit of housekeeping while you're using panel pins take to unhook the whole box the whole blue box and bring it to the desk. Do not take a handful of panel pins out the box and put them on the desk in front of you because that's the way we get we lose them. Right now what we've got to do is to put some glue on the end of this here and nail them together. So put that in the vise, that way around, take some PVA glue and squirt a bit on there. Look at the quantity that I'm using. Take your um, piece that you just put the panel pin through, position it so it's flush, literacy link there, with the edge of the piece that you're holding in the vise. Just push it down and you'll find you just push the pointed bit of the panel pin into the wood and that stops it slipping around. That's why you prepare it by putting a pin in with the point just coming through. Right, put the other piece in the vise and do the other end. So you end up with a rather wide flat bottom U-shaped piece. There. If you do a one, uh, glued one side on, pinned it on, you need you've basically got a, a wide flat bottom U shape. You need to put that in the vise, and you're going to glue the other piece across the top. Now, um, put a bit of glue on, the usual amount, and line up one end. Push it in place so that the the pin end of the pin just makes a mark in the wood and get it in. Now on the other end, this one's okay, but you might find you've got to actually sort of push it to make sure it lines up flush. It must line up flush, otherwise it won't be square. If you've got to force it a little bit, then you've got to do it. Right, treat that gently for 20 minutes or so while it dries.